Food insecurity is a common issue, and that's why a local food kitchen in the Diamond City is fighting hunger during the holidays. 28-22, Eyewitness News reporter Julie Dunphy joins us live in Wilkes-Barre with more on an annual food distribution. Julie. Nick, Candice, good evening. Many are touched by the spirit of giving. And here at St. Vincent de Paul Kitchen in downtown Wilkesbury, more than 130 turkeys and all of the fixings were given out today. And what we found this morning and this evening while the drive was going on is that even those receiving are in the giving mood. To some, it's just a turkey, but to others, it's a meal they don't take for granted. That means a lot, yeah. That means a lot. I'll help you out. Dozens of people picked up a Christmas dinner from St. Vincent de Paul Kitchen to cook at home this weekend. The annual food distribution is made possible with the help of CEO and donations. With the high prices of food, Hopefully this helps them out to uh, still have a good meal for Christmas Day. David and Joseph Servin tell Eyewitness News food stamps only go so far. And they're grateful the food bank steps in to help people in need like them. The food places is healthy for people like us when we can't really afford too much for the holidays. The kitchen had 300 turkeys to give away with all the fixings, even dessert. How about a cake, a big cake? What am I sure do? William Amison says despite needing a little boost himself, he also likes to give back around the holidays when he can. I have a couple of homeless friends that come to my house and have dinner. So uh, I, I treat them to dinner on Christmas. I treated them for Thanksgiving. I'm treating them for uh, Christmas also. After picking up the food at the Christmas giveaway, many then stood in line next door for a hot meal. Food insecurity has increased this year, mainly because the prices of everything has gone up. That's why St. Vincent de Paul Kitchen is providing more produce to help ease the burden. Tuesday's holiday food distribution is in addition to the regular meals provided by the kitchen daily. The hot meals will be provided this weekend between 11 a.m. and 12.30 p.m. on Christmas Eve and on Christmas Day. And those hot meals can be found here at St. Vincent de Paul Kitchen in Wilkesbury and at St. Francis of Assisi in Scranton. And one more thing, there are actually plenty of turkeys left with some of those fixings, more than 100 turkeys here. So if you didn't get one or you know someone who could use a turkey, they can go ahead and stop by here at St. Vincent de Paul in Wilkesbury between the hours of 11 and 12.30 when they usually give their uh, lunch hot lunch meals out during the week. So there is still time to give. Nick, Candace. Oh, such a generous effort there. They do it every year too. Mm -hmm. Julie, thanks.